Apple's latest announcement of the iPhone 15 series has sparked interest, but rumors and leaks are already circulating regarding the iPhone 16. According to popular analyst Jeff Poo, Apple might be returning to a previous strategy of using a single chipset for all models in the iPhone 16 lineup, which is different from the approach used in the iPhone 14 lineup. In previous iterations, Apple introduced distinct chipsets for non-pro and pro models. For example, in the iPhone 14 series, the regular iPhone 14 and 14 Plus models had the A15 Bionic chipset, while the Pro models featured the A15 Pro Bionic chipset based on TSMC's 3M process. Similarly, in the iPhone 15 series, both non-Pro models had an A16 Bionic chipset, while the Pro versions came with an A17 Pro Bionic chipset based on the 3M process. The latest information suggests that for the iPhone 16 series, both the regular and Pro models will be powered by the same A18 Bionic chipset, which is also based on TSMC's 3M process. This change implies that there won't be a distinction between chipsets for the regular and Pro models. However, there will likely be differences between the two lineups in terms of features like display technology, camera capabilities, and other specifications. It's essential to note that this information is based on rumors and speculations, and nothing is confirmed until Apple officially announces the iPhone 16, which is still a year away. Many rumors and leaks circulate in the lead-up to a new iPhone release, so it's advisable to approach these details with a degree of skepticism and await official information. The move to a single chipset for the iPhone 16 could have implications for consumers and their choices, so it will be interesting to see how Apple approaches this strategy if it turns out to be accurate. Keep an eye out for more updates on iPhone 16 rumors as they emerge. Feel free to share your thoughts on this news in the comments section.